Hey everybody, Dan here with Roth, Spencer, and Joe to talk to you about some stuff that you may have heard about, answer some questions, and let you know what's going on here at Screen Junkies. As you may or may not have heard, we are under new ownership. We have a new owner, uh, a place called Fandom. Fandom has acquired Screen Junkies, not just the name, not just the brand. They have acquired the sets. They have acquired us. They have acquired these microphones. They have acquired <laughs> this copy of Air Bud on VHS and this Skeletor figure and uh, that anything. ant farm over there. <laughs> exactly. We have. We have an why do we farm? have an ant farm? I don't know why, why do we have, we have an, an ant farm. farm. But fandom owns it now. They own that ant farm. Uh, <laughs> anything that you've seen or heard on Screen Junkies, uh, we are now part of fandom. Uh, so what does that mean right now? Well, it means that. Uh, Nothing, really, at the moment. Nothing that you know or like about Screen Junkies is going to change right now. Uh, they're not coming in here and cleaning house, or they're not coming in here and canceling everything. Basically, it is as happens anytime there is a change of ownership. There's going to be a transition period. But while we're working through that, everything you know and love is going to be right here. We're going to be doing the same shows. We're going to be doing it at the same time. We're going to be on these same sets for at least a while. Uh, and so everything that you know and love, even this, this space door to my left that no one ever sees on camera because it was put somewhere that would never be shot. It's a really cool door. It's a, it's a cool door. We can Space promise door. you that it's a cool door. Um, so that cool things just right off there. camera <laughs> on this set. <laughs> and farms, um, space doors. No, right now, nothing is gonna change because Phantom is really invested and really, really invested in working with them on figuring out new opportunities without completely upsetting the apple cart as it is right now. Plus, Roth, the, the thing that we're really worried about is Comic-Con, which yeah. is less than 30 days away. We're, you I know, are right in the middle of spearheading the effort to plan that that's what where our focus is so you know if you're worried that things are going to change and tomorrow you're going to turn on screen junkies and it's going to be something completely new that's not what's going to happen yeah we are full steam ahead on comic-con we're actually going to do some fun stuff there with fandom so we'll start to see what that looks like then and also the question might be why 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 i wonder that's hey, always my question and like, why oh good question joe <laughs> Thank you mm. for asking. Well, a lot of it is kind of like business paper, blah, 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 Captain Business Unikitty. Um, but <laughs> other than that is we always want to grow. And in conversations, it just felt like Phantom was a really, really good fit for us. Um, they are one of the biggest, and Spencer's going to get into this a little bit, but they are one of the biggest um, gaming, TV, and movie sites in the world. And we're one of the biggest YouTube channel, thanks to these gentlemen right here. Um, that sounds so bright. But I guess it's true. Who's bigger, so Roth? <laughs> Actually, probably some people. Probably yeah. some people. So, like I feel like I could name a bunch right now, but yeah. I won't like gaming. Whatever. It's not a contest. Um, it's not a contest. <laughs> this is a very good fit. We'd come in um, eighth. <laughs> <laughs> we go together the way that good things do, like Raptors and Doors, Joe. JTE and Sylvester Stallone. Uh, 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 Patrick Swayze and Jeff Goldblum. Mm. Did they ever appear on? They no, should but they have. certainly they should have. have. Uh, arm wrestling and backwards hats. Yes, yeah. all of these things go very well, <laughs> well together <laughs> and we go well with fandom. And the reason is, is because um, we, you know, we love the fact that people have their individual passions in life. We were having a conversation about this earlier today. I know somebody that's obsessed with the movie Midnight Cowboy and has literally recreated half of the movie in models. Um, people have their individual fandoms and we celebrate that. <laughs> it's a fun aside. Yeah. I'm saying. <laughs> Puzzle piece. I love when people love things. Um, and that's what fandom is all about. It's where you can go to find the people and the communities um, that love the things that you do. That's sort of what we have done with each other here at Screen Junkies. Yeah. Uh, when I heard the news, uh, uh, I, I went, uh, <laughs> because I didn't know what fandom was. And then when I looked it up, I went, oh, of course I know those people. They're Wikia. They're Wikipedia. Media. They're the Marvel database. Uh, they're ch they've changed their name to fandom, but they have like every nerd or pop culture beyond community uh, website where it's all fan run. Um, uh, and there's edited pieces, there's editorials. They have so much cool stuff up there. Anytime you're Googling like, I don't know, what's something you'd Google? Do Who's anything like, Doctor Who. Literally, yeah. Yeah. okay, I wouldn't Google Doctor Who things because <laughs> I would know them. However, like, the first time you were watching Game of Thrones, you guys probably went, who is the Night King? Yes, who is this guy that just Always showed up? like the first thing that shows up. I've been on their websites hundreds of yeah. times for Honest Trailers. Or like, and uh, maybe Honest Trailers will be there too someday. Who knows? When your buddy Jacob insists that they're called Tremor Monsters and not Graboids, and you're yeah. like, all right, let's fix that. <laughs> let's settle this. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's where you go. Uh, so, uh, yeah, it's been a year. 
uh, for us. It's 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 been a year, uh, but um, uh, we did wanted to take a second too to just say thank you for continuing to stick with us uh, this year. Uh, there's been a lot of changes, a lot of stuff going on. Uh, but what remains consistent is the fact that we get to kind of come here every day and hang out with you guys. Uh, means a lot to us, and it only happens because you are on the other end uh, hanging out with us and watching the shows every day. So let us know what you kind of think. Uh, blow in the comments. Hit us on Twitter. Uh, ask questions. We might have answers. Probably not. We might yeah. not. But I don't we know. definitely we want to hear from you, and we'll know what you're thinking about. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. And if everybody keeps asking the same questions, then uh, we'll, we'll go in search of answers for those, at the very least. At the very least. Exactly. We can promise you that. So uh, we'll see you guys completely unchanged with Skeletor, Space Door, and Ant Farm tomorrow morning.